Hello everyone and welcome back to Random Games. I just want to say one thing before we start guys. Thank you so much for enjoying this series. It, uh, it's been doing really well and I appreciate that. I know that every time it's different games so you never really know what you're going to get. So thank you for putting your faith in me to actually find something that's going to be entertaining. But anyway, let's play some games. So the first game we're going to be playing today, guys, is called Chesto at the Checkout. It was sent to me a long time ago in my email by the developer of the game, and I said one day I would play it, and here we are. I don't know what it's about. It's some sort of, like, you know, supermarket game where you have to check people out, I think. Let's just go ahead and go to work. Press space to move the conveyor belt. Oh, okay. <laughs> he moves with it. Now what? Beep. We got an item. So is this all I gotta do? Is this the only control this present space? Cause so far, it's pretty damn easy. They didn't tell me any other things I gotta do. Oh, now I gotta spin the items so they actually get checked out. Okay, there you go, that one, fantastic. Good stuff. Oh, barcode, I got it. Beep. And then it just flew over to that side of the screen and landed in the cart. Oh yes, everything's got barcodes these days, man. Good stuff, now get the hell out of here. You don't expect me to get the other thing cause that's gone, okay? Why are you still standing here? This is somebody else's groceries now. You probably should not be standing there. I don't buy this shit. Come on, man, why do you gotta be a jerk? Place all items in the cart. Okay, well I don't care if you buy this shit or not. It's still going in that. Or not, because it won't let me. Backspace to unpin. There we go. Mmm, there. Get the hell out of here, buddy. I don't give a shit what you want. He actually left? Good. Okay, ma'am, I'm sorry about all the confusion back there. It's all good. Let me just go ahead and grab this. Is this chocolate? Is this how you buy chocolate? You just take big old pieces of chocolate and lay it on the checkout line? Because that, that's not a good way to buy food, okay? Can we have a faster cashier, please? Can you shut your trap? You want, you want, you want to have this job? Huh? I'm not getting paid enough for your bullshit, woman. Go to hell. Don't think Chesto is going to pay you for your overtime. Wait, does that mean, oh, but see you later, lady. Is, am I done work? Or is she telling me that I'm so slow that by the time I'm done, it's gonna be closed? Either way, it's fine with me. Okay, I'm just gonna keep on doing what I'm doing. Oh baby, you guys are gonna be eating good tonight. I've taught my children not to eat things that have been on the floor. Oh, come on. Seriously, what is that supposed to be? That doesn't look like anything you'd eat anyway, so maybe you should just shut up about it. Wake up, you've already scanned this chest of rice. Well, I mean, whatever. I don't even care, okay? I'm not getting paid to do it right, I'm just getting paid to do it. That's what I always said when I had a job. A real job, anyway. There. Look, that's all your items. Are you happy? Go home. Chesto at the checkout. You sold nine items during regular- Jesus, what's happening right now? New customer. Don't get fired to unlock more. I think I got fired. I did. I did get fired. You are not fast enough. You are fired. I sold nine items during regular hours, and I sold 13 items during unpaid overtime. Penalty for one item scan multiple times. Minus 20, bonus for working extra fast, plus 36. Don't ask me how I worked extra fast when I had to stay for 13 items of unpaid overtime. Minus 194 euros. Yep, that's definitely below minimum wage. I'm not very good at checking people out. Look, I got one more thing to say to you, you Squidward looking bitch. I just want you to know that your hand looks like a penis. That is it. You gonna fire me? Well, I'm out of here. So the next game we're gonna play, guys, is called Loss of Fluid. You have to take this airplane and you need to get it to the ground by just controlling either the left turbine or the right turbine. Uh, we should be reading this, so let's restart so we can actually do that. Well, it's a good day to fly, isn't it? What the? The hydraulic pressure is dropping. Oh no, we are rapidly losing fuel too. Hmm, your plane is taking a piss. I am losing control, I can only control the engines. Oh damn, mayday, 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 requesting emergency landing. Oh, okay, so this is the part where you try again by actually trying. I was just, I was just here for the story this time. Let's give it a go. Here we go, okay, so now I got left and right and I gotta try and control the plane. If you, if you use both buttons at the same time, you can lift yourself back up again. Roger, the closest airport to your position is northeast something something. Hold on, I can go northeast, I know how to do that. Here we go. So, <laughs> oh god, this is ridiculously hard to control. I'm going. I'm going somewhere. Oh, I see some things. That's good. Can you guys think you could tell me where that uh, airport is again? Because I totally forgot. Actually, I didn't know in the first place, okay? 
Okay, I missed something very important just then, guys. You can see it on the screen here now. Uh, whatever that says, I'm going to try and um, uh, do it. So if I'm losing fuel, that means I'm probably not going to have a whole lot of time to get where I need to go. But they didn't really give me a... Uh... Oh, what's that? What's that over here? Is this something good? No, I think it's just more like mountains and stuff. Well, crap. What am I going to do now? I, I guess I just got to fly around until I die. That's, that's life for you. Can I just go ahead and land anywhere? Because I do not see anywhere I can land right now. That's what I'm going to do, okay? I'm just going to come down to the ground, and I'm going to make a lovely landing in this plane. And, and nothing bad is going to happen. Yes. Come on. I don't see I don't see a shadow. Here's the shadow. It's coming up here now. So I just need to make sure that that shadow doesn't get too close to me until I'm just absolutely... Is that mountains? Those are trees. No, I wanted a clear place to land, damn it. Turn me around. There. Okay, let's try this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Come on. You got it. No, wrong way. Wrong way. Wrong... Okay, we ran out of fuel. That was a very bad time. It has been an hour honor to fly beside you. Yeah, thanks for the sarcasm, asshole. Northeast at 306. That's where the nearest airport is. I don't know where Northeast 306 is. I'm just going to go in the general Northeast direction and see what happens, okay? Then something else came up a little while later, and whatever it was, it was probably what I needed to know. We cannot even deploy the gears. Sir, you'll have to wiggle the airplane to release them. Oh, I get it. Okay. How do I do that? Come on. Gear. Oh, they came down. Okay, you made it. Gears are down. Is this going to make it harder to fly the plane? And where's the airport anyway? Was <laughs> am I supposed to go to it? I don't know. I don't even think I'm supposed to go to it, guys. Let's just go down here, okay? We'll dodge the trees. We'll dodge. Uh, I guess that might be water or something. And we'll land this freaking plane. I see the shadow coming in. Just don't get too close there, shadow. Okay, I'm not ready yet. Yes, beautiful. Don't lose control now. Oh, I think we're gonna do it, guys. I think we're gonna do it. Do I have to go to the airport to do it? Man, I don't know where Northeast 306 is. You haven't given me anything here. Damn it. Okay, wiggling the gear down again. Here we go. Okay, the landing gear has been deployed. That's good. Maybe the first officer can tell me how to get to the freaking airport while he's at it. Can you do that, first officer? Is that going to be too much trouble? Or should I just keep on taking a leak in the air? I don't see an airport, guys. I think you're just trolling me with this whole airport thing. I think I'm going to try and land on the ground again. You know, the way I did before where I died. Ooh, look at that. Am I in the airport now or something? I managed to land a plane, and these vehicles come out of nowhere. I mean, I'm assuming they're vehicles. What, what are we doing now, anyway? Am I just blowing air at you guys? Okay, hey, welcome. You landed. Touchdown score, um, d didn't give me one? Okay, so the total score is 3,039 points, and uh, it's calculated based on a bunch of things. It's time, airplane angle, center line offset, and vertical speed. Okay, good. Congratulations me. I managed to do it. This, ladies and gentlemen, is Comb Over Monster Campaign Manager, where your job is to get Donald Trump to the number one spot in the polls so that he can win the 2016 presidential election. I know, I'm getting kind of scared just thinking about it, guys, but that's what we're gonna do today. So, strap in. I like how there's actually like a difficulty setting, guys. You can play on easy, normal, hard, and insane. And whatever you click on, Donald Trump's come over turns into a come over monster. Look at that thing right there. That is freaking terrifying. Okay, we're gonna go with normal. Here we go. Let's go, Donald. Let's go, let's go win this election. So the way it works is you are this giant Donald Trump head, okay? And what you need to do is you need to walk around and touch the red ones to turn them into Donald Trump supporters, okay? It's pretty straightforward. I don't think you do anything with the blue ones. Maybe if you shoot tweets at them. No, not even then. Okay, but if you shoot tweets at people like this, okay, by clicking, you can actually uh, turn them that way as well. And there's the other candidates. The other candidates don't get to be giant heads because that's a special thing that's, that's reserved just for Donald Trump because he is just so damn amazing. Build wall, E or enter key. So you can build walls in this game. I don't really understand how it works, guys. You press E and then you get this wall here so you can actually like, you know, move around like this and just build a wall. <laughs> yeah. And you just pop down here and then you, you know, you got yourself a little wall. And what you do is once you get your wall, nobody else can get in. They can't get the voters. And you take all those... Oh, God, what am I doing? I am just so... I'm so bad at this. Why can't I be a better Donald Trump? That's all I've ever wanted. 
Oh man. Oh god, is that Hillary Clinton? Oh Jesus, I forgot that I can. <laughs> yeah, that is definitely Hillary Clinton. So if you hold space or uh, shift, guys, you can walk around as the uh, giant comb over monster. And what happens is when you when you land on all these little signs here, you kill them. See, they're all dead right now. But because they're dead, they're now undecided voters. So they're not Republican or Democrat. Therefore, you can take them for yourself. Because right now, you can only take, I think, the red ones, which are Democrats. Man, I'm not even from the United States. I don't know how this shit works. I just know that somehow it does, okay? And somehow Donald Trump is in the running to be president of the United States. And he's leading in the polls. I know. Okay, so we're just gonna close in this. Don't get, don't get over there. Who the hell are you? What do you think you're doing? Guys, get out of my wall, okay? Get out of my country. Hillary, no. Hillary, thank you. Jesus, I almost had Hillary Clinton in my wall. So now there's just this guy over here. We still need to get rid of him, but, I mean, I don't know how well I can do that. I just broke my own wall, man. Everybody's inside my wall, too. Can you guys just get out? Holy crap. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, the good news, guys, is that Donald Trump is leading in the Republican poll. So, yeah, I got that wrong earlier. I wasn't really paying attention to the left. The Republicans are red, and those are the ones that you want. And the Democrats, you have to actually kill the Democrats and bring them back as undecided voters, like this. Die, you Democrat bitches! And now you walk back over here, you wait for them to revive themselves with the question marks, and then you touch them all. Just, just touch every single one of them. You want voters? Touch those people. Okay, I just went to the instructions. It says build walls to contain other candidates or protect your voters. That is so smart. Oh my god, so I can take Hillary now and be like, yeah, fuck you, Hillary. I'm building a wall around you, okay? What are you gonna do about it? You're just gonna have to stay in my wall all day. Did it work? There she is. Take that, Hillary, you bitch. <laughs> She's going over here and trying to fire her tweets around. I lost a lot of support then, guys. Uh, while I was, you know, doing things I shouldn't have been. But now I got Hillary contained. That's good. Even though she's not even really a problem for me. This guy's a problem for me. Get the hell out of here, this guy. I don't know who you are, but I don't want you here. Because you're screwing up my election. There. Ooh. Ooh, I got it. Okay. So eventually, once I, uh, once I have everybody imprisoned, okay, with my, with my genius wall idea, we'll, uh, we'll have a pretty easy job getting all these people to become, uh, you know, Trump voters, Trump supporters. Here we go. This guy's next. Do what we can for him. See, they don't really have any AI. They don't know what they're doing. Boom. All of a sudden, there's a wall around them. You can have a couple supporters if you want them. Man, I am just destroying all these voters. It is amazing. I only got 21% right now, but I am leading in the Republicans, so that's good. Maybe I, I could just pop a wall over here with you guys as well, if you don't mind, so I could just, you know, get you stuck in here. Come on. Oh, crap. That guy got out, but that's fine, because the other guy's in there. He ain't leaving. Maybe I could just grab a quick wall down here as well. Come on. Come on, walls. Okay, currently I'm being beaten by this guy named Walker. I don't know where he is, but I'm gonna find him, okay? It's very important that I... F is that you? Walker, you son of a bitch. Get over there. Get in that Get in that wall over there. There you go. That's the way. That's the way you want to go. And now I'm gonna put a wall around you, you bitch. There. Oh, shit. He got out of the wall. Come on, man. Not fair. I mean, okay, fine. It is technically fair, but don't do it. Just watch, guys. His numbers are gonna... Hey, hey, what are you doing here? Why are there so many freaking candidates? You guys are not gonna win the election. Nobody even knows who you are. Stop. Oh, man, guys. I just got a speed boost. Apparently, that's what the Super Packs does. It gives you a really tiny speed boost, and it worked. It was nice. Okay, guys. We're coming up on a win here. Okay, this is a very big moment for me. Holy crap. 39%. Oh crap, went back down to 38. I think we just need to get to 40% and we'll win. Come on, Donald Trump, you can do it. You can become president of the United States. Oh, Jesus. I'm winning. Keep my poll numbers at plus 40% for 30 seconds. I can do it. I can do it. Okay, all the other guys, they're trapped inside their little, um, you know, their little walls. And I'm just gonna reign over the entire United States. Come on, come on. Wake up so I can make you voters. Go, go, go. There, got him. Okay, 43%. Oh, 10 seconds left. Here we go. I'm converting more. 44. Trump. Trump, baby. Trump 2016. Woo! I did it. Boom. I am in the history of the United States. Me, Donald John Trump. Amen, brother. Amen. Okay, guys. Well, that was another episode of Random Games. I really hope you enjoyed it. And as always, if there's any games you guys would like to see in this series, you can leave them down below in the comments. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.